In this tutorial, I'll show you how to create point groups in Civil 3D. Initially, if a point file is included into Civil 3D, all those points will come into the All Points group here. So underneath the, uh, to, under your tool space again on that Prospector tab, if you list on that one, you should see point groups. You can expand that and see these All Points. Now when I click on All Points, this will give the point ID, the elevation, or the easting, northing, and elevation there. And notice that it also does bring in this raw description and full description. At this point, there's no differentiation between all these points. If I scroll down, there is uh, TS points and PS points in here, so different perimeter type points uh, that are all listed. Now, we want to start separating these out, and the benefit of this is that you are able to visualize those groups separately. So one group could be visualized with certain markings, uh, while others would be have separate from that. Also, you can use certain point groups for surfaces or other features in Civil 3D. In order to do that, we will come to back to the point group label here on the just point groups and put new. Here we will go ahead and just na uh, name a new group. So we're going to just call this one original one ground shots. And we will go to the include tab. So there's different ways to do this. The easiest at this point is to just go to include and anything with a raw description matching GS is going to be included. Now I could put GS star and then anything else beyond that would be acceptable. So GS anything would come into play here. Um, and we will just hit apply and OK. Now you'll notice that a certain section of data of these points was changed to now this ground shots and it began to be, become visualized separately. Uh, this, in this case here, if you look in, uh, look in here, each of these shots now has a the shot number, 85, the elevation, and GS. All that can be modified now based off of that point group, which we'll show you in the next video.